Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am the Marmoset and we are playing XCOM Enemy Unknown. Welcome back! In our last episode, we did really quite well. We were able to get all of our squad in and out intact. We took advantage of some of the AI being a little bit dopey in places and were able to exploit that for explosionary fun. We've got an autopsy coming up in a bit of that, the result of this, a scope upgrade, then a load of satellites and a satellite nexus, and then 26 days to the cancer report. We've got a couple soldiers who took a little bit of a beating. We've got a load more promotions, which we'll sort out in a bit. But in the interim, let us carry on scanning for activity. We're not going to go for the alien base assault just yet. Oh, there we go. Sign new research. Any base such as I don't think our squad is ready. Combat stims available for manufacture. Okay. Powerful stimulant. Temporary boost. Fair enough. Lack alloys for the plasma rifle. So it looks like we will be building the EMP cannon. Improve our chance of collecting engineering resources. Alright, back to mission control we go. Scope upgrade. Let's quit that design new project. Let's quickly check out the barracks and our soldiers. We've got our support wounded. Ah, our new heavy has a level up. So, bullet swarm. Find the primary weapon as the first action, no longer as the turn. Or, hollow targeting, plus 10 aim. Hmm. I think I will take the aim. We've got a lot of rookie soldiers around, and having that extra bonus is going to be very handy. So, with that in mind, we will head back to Mission Control, and spin time on. Commander, our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your orders. In that case, we should head to the city room and launch this satellite. So, where do we want to put it? Hmm. Bonus for North America. So I get a hundred for launching it to Canada. And I get the same there for launching it for Japan. I don't really want to lose another council member. So I think we'll go for where it's causing the most amount of problem and we will send it to Japan. Launch satellite. satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity. Yep. Additional uplink required. I'm already building one, thank you very much. Come the end of the month, we should have a quite a large chunk of cash coming in, which makes a nice change from previously. Scan for activity. UFO power sausage. Um, I'm sorry, Canada, but I'm afraid I cannot meet that request. Even if I wanted to, I would probably be keeping the power sources for myself. EMP Karen is ready. Ship repair project, EMP Karen is available for manufacture, so this will. Vice Vision, set up with the possible alien across, should bring down the UFO, minimal damage to the artifacts and things carried aboard. Except. New foundry project. Repair the ship's in progress. Fair enough. Can't start that, so my research guys are going to have to sit idle for a little bit. Build by items. Scopes are apparently already improved. I can spot out another. So the EMP cannon requires a load of alloys, alloys, alloys. So that's a slight upgrade on some of it, but not as good as the laser cannon. Dodge Matrix, Sectoid Corpses, which don't have very many of. I've already got a load of satellites queued up. I want to keep that cache sitting around just as a backup. I would really love to get some more of these things, but um, so be it. We'll just have to wait and see. So we're heading back to Mission Control. Come on, you Contact alien scum. Detected. Thank you. UFO has landed. Hmm. Contact UFO-0, United States, UFO class abductor. I will be sending the Sky Ranger. Hello, team. So, we've got some new names. We've got support 
two assaults are heavy, and another sniper. I don't think I need two snipers, so I am going to switch out your armor and your auxiliary weapon, clear you out, and bring one of our rookies along. And the next up is Venki Kotsky. Kotsi, I think. Anyway, edit unit, load out, have a better gun, better armor, have a better gun, have the arc thrower. Why? Because the rookie always gets that. Yep, righto, okay, so we've got full set of laser and plasma weapons, med kit, grenades and explosives, you've got that scope. Is this the upgraded scope? Aim of 105 plus 10. Wow, you can always look at getting... You're talking about getting a pretty good shot there, aren't you? And you got your climbing scoot. Yep, okay, Zero, I think you're ready to go. Launch. I've adjusted my volume slightly, so if that launch thing was slightly loud, let me know in the comments and I will turn them around a bit. Prepare for deployment, strike one. Begin assault. Operation. Get ready to deploy. Our AO is within the continental United States. Ladies and gentlemen. Reports indicate the UFO is set down in a sparsely populated area. We need to stay sharp and eliminate the invaders. Thank you, Central. I was trying to be... Anyway. We're going to the United States, ladies and gentlemen, for Operation Democratic Penguin. <laughs> uh, what fun. Daylight. I like daylight. Daylight means that it's like to sneak up on me. Roger that, big sky. Strike one, you are green to deploy. Approach with extreme caution. Current enemy status at the site is unknown. I'm assuming they are probably going to be really pissed that I've decided to turn up and ruin their party. So, let's do our usual thing of snudging forward carefully and slowly. How far can you get? You can also get that far. Yep, that's good. We've got cover. Possibly revealed a bit more of the map than I necessarily immediately wanted it to. Well, you're better off having how Where can you get to? Nowhere particularly far. Alright, you come up to here. And you can cap that corner. And then we will pop the sniper. Let's just double check. You don't have anywhere you can grapple to. So, come up to here. Alright, switch. And Overwatch. Overwatch. I wish that was always the same button so I could just shortcut my way through that. Much more quickly. Here comes the enemy activity. Sorry, you guys are all getting your feet wet, but so be it. And now we're going to be heading up and over. Start with the person furthest back. Android, you've got really awful movement. Um, I have to just double time you up to here to get you actually engaged. There we go. Pretty sure you have pretty good cover there because that's hard rock. It will probably be doing a two-stage move from here. Yeah, we're not getting any visual over the top of that, so the enemy are on the other side of this ridge. So I can afford to... Do I want to pop up? No, I do not want to pop that area visually with this move. It would not be a good idea. bit more visual. It's a hell of a UFO we've got. So, yeah, so I want his move up onto there to start the next turn. 
because we're going to get an awful lot of visual information. Let me move up onto there. I don't want to be able to react to it rather than them reacting to me. So. That's a disc. Pretty unhappy to see it, but it appears to be on the very edge. Zero does not have a shot. Still not activated it. Spread you guys out just a little bit in case things do explode. Where can you get to that might be useful? Okay. Even less visibility and movement. People going up over the top on anything else, so. That's a question. Do you have a shot? No. Do you have a shot? No. Do you have a shot? No. Okay, so I haven't activated them yet, so. Let's bring everybody round. like the lack of cover I have on that side, but I think the enemy are all on one side of me, so let's have at least one person on Overwatch guarding that flank, and then you can come up to here, and then everyone on Overwatches, so if anyone is dumb enough to make a move, Yes, hello. Enemy in sight. Yep, there's the drone with his drones. You've got a far too much movement for my liking. So, you don't have a shot, no shot, no shot, no shot, does have a shot, does have a shot. Must be that in the way. So you'd likely have a shot there. Let's see how much damage you can do with your first shot. And then we'll make a cake and a couple people up from there. Critical hits, pretty good to see. Could be surprised to finish it off. That would kill give me an awful lot more space than you have in Because I hate those things. Particularly the fact that they explode, so if they get close, they're in real trouble. 45% chance to hit. 45% chance to hit on both of them. Yeah, might as well take the shot. Adjusting sights. Yeah, you should bloody hope you should be. Don't quite know why I don't have line of sight on them, but I will be excessively cautious. And overwatch. I suspect it might be just that drone thing got activated. Here you go, they move out. They're starting to lose ground. There's one down. Another one's fallen back. Okay, do we have useful cover ahead of us? Not as much as I would like. Alright, looks like we'll be swinging slightly further around and down. Come over to here. Enemy spotted. Joy! Well, aren't I am pleased that I have triggered you. Okay, what have you got on you? The stunner. That's out for now. Well, you might as well take a shot from where you are. 
any 5% chance to hit. Take the 100% chance to hit with 7 damage. Thank you. One, forty-five, forty-five. Take that one. If you can prune him off, it's just one. Thank you. Any grenades? Okay, so let's see if I can get people in a position. We well, start taking some shots. Fifty-six, fifty-six. Let's focus fire on the closer one. Good critical hit, or at least a decent one. Come down to there. Yep. Ah, oh, thirty-eight percent chance. At least the hollow targeting kicked in, so the next one should be slightly better. Let's see if you've got a shot from there. I do hope so. Yes, you do. With the scatter laser. 16% chance to hit. <laughs> Made it! So we've got one dude left. I can't get in a position where I can easily see him. So let's just overwatch and see what we get. They're falling back. I'll take that. You running away? Is it a that alien there? It's not carrying a weapon like the others. What could it be doing? I don't know. There we go. It resolved itself. It had a bit of a think. X-rays got me out. Cover my flank. Watch the sides! Okay, so I've got a lot of guys who are in a lot of trouble. So we need to rearrange their positioning. You need to get over here. You need to come back. Actually, where can you get to? Can you flip round? Yes, you can. You do have a shot from where you are, and you need to get up to here. Right, okay. And you... you do have a shot, which implies to me that that location should also have a shot. It does, okay. Let's start with what Zero can do. You've uh, got a lot of hit points, so we've got one guy who apparently decided he didn't want to have any cover. So let's remove his stupidity from the field. Thank you very I'm much. I'm out of firepower over here. Yep, that's fine by me. What have we got? Yeah. Can I run and gun? No, apparently I had to move you too far. Well, you look like you're a melee guy, so I don't know how much movement you've got, but... Let's shoot him lots. And kill him! Fair enough. Right, who have I got left? You apparently don't have any move left at all. You've got space, you've got move. Right, okay, you're the one with our hollow targeting, so I want you to take the shot. Don't mind if you miss or not, but you'll get a bonus. Damn it. A nice bonus. So, see, it's up to 76%. I do hope no one panics. Ok, 
Okay. You now apparently don't have a shot. That's fun. Um, give me over one instead then. Flyers. Unhelpful. <clears throat> Didn't want you shooting at them. Did not want you. Did not want that overwatched. I wanted. And you're back. What fun. That's gonna be a soldier dead. <sighs> what are you gonna do? Okay, who is my medic? You are my medic. Okay, so can I just... Three turns, okay. Right, if I want to get to you, I need to get rid of him. I'd also very much like to get rid of him. So, you have the scatter laser. 88% chance to hit, 7 damage. Do it. Okay, so that makes him move. Right, okay, so... You're not immediately flanked. Your shots include him and him. You're out of ammunition. Okay. Home percent chance to hit only does three points of damage. I'm just going to have to pour fire on you, aren't I? Apparently I've got a double tap. So I'll hit you again. Who's got the... Stunner. You did. That's a move into cover, and a move that stuns. Should get him definitely done. Fingers crossed. Say good night. Target disabled. All right, now get back down into cover. Okay. Do I have anyone else? I do. You're up. Move up to here. I do have a shot. Um, yeah, just take it and see if you can reduce their numbers. Thank you. And you... Yeah, just try and hit the guy. Bye-bye. Dead in the water, dear. Now it's a case of weathering damage for a turn until we can get down and rescue our injured teammate. The Mouton's the problem. If he moves, he's in a position to really flank me hard again. Instead, he's double moved and backed up. Okay. I can't get to you immediately this turn. So how or who can I get rid of? Who of you 